वेलकम टू द बी आई एस पी सोल्यूशन सो आर टूडेज टॉपिक इज जर्नल पोस्टिंग वट डज जर्नल मीन्स अ जर्नल इज अ डिटेल अकाउंट दैट रिकॉर्ड्स ऑल द फाइनेंशियल ट्रांजेक्शन ऑफ अ बिजनेस टू बी यूज फॉर द फ्यूचर रिकनसाइलिंग ऑफ अकाउंट्स एंड द ट्रांसफर ऑफ इन्फॉर्मेशन टू अदर ऑफिशियल अकाउंटिंग रिकॉर्ड्स सच एज द जर्नल लेजर जर्नल If we talk in a layman language, a journal is a diary you keep of daily events dealing with the specific industry or a field, or we can say it's a primary book of accounts where all the transactions are recorded for the first time in a progressive order. What is journal entry? Journal entry is is that it's the entry which is recorded in the journal is the journal entry it's a record of transactions debit and credit aspect with the help of double entry bookkeeping system that means the entry which is recorded in the journal is the is called the as the journal entry every journal entry has two effects one is has a uh, one side is a debit and another is a credit because it follows the double entry bookkeeping system okay it's the rule in accounts because every transactions has two effects one has debit and one has credit and now we'll see what is journal posting journal posting means the act of transferring a journal entry into the ledger account is called as journal posting journal posting is done inside a ledger which is also known as the principal book of accounts this is where all the ledger accounts are maintained that means once you pass the journal entry you need to post that journal entry into the ledger account okay you can understand this by seeing one example i have passed one entry like i have purchased the furniture in cash so i have passed the entry as furniture account debit to cash account credit with 1000 okay now there are two ledgers one is the furniture account and another is the cash account in furniture account my entry will be posted as to cash account here you can read from this ledger as furniture account debit to cash account credit 1000 and in cash account this entry will be posted as by furniture account and you can read it from here furniture account debit to cash account credit okay so this is where first we pass the journal entry and then we post this journal entry into the ledger accounts okay now let us see how we do the journal posting in fccs first click on the jo consolidation journals i have passed some of the entries like when you click on create this window will pop up okay so you have to define the povs like label you give any label name which will be displayed as your journal entry okay on the top of the journal entry so give any label name give uh, the entry which you are passing as a description like we used to do in accounts like when you pass the entry and you give the narration to understand that entry okay this it is the same they are uh, journal type select the journal type uh, they are uh, basically two types regular and auto reversing and i am passing the uh, regular journal entry so i have selected the regular data source as journal input okay and group you can select any and entity currency is automatically selected okay and you define uh, other povs also like scenario year period i have taken 2015 as a year, my year period as january consolidation as entity input view as periodic okay just define all the correct povs and select the entity for which entity you are passing the entry pass the entry okay like select do uh, pick up the members from this action tab you pick up your members okay predefined members or you can uh, make another member also just pick up those members and just pass the amount as debit or credit okay i have uh, passed this entry as sales done on credit so my entry is trade receivables account debit with 770 to revenue international account credit with 770 okay after passing and my variance is zero after passing this entry click on the save and when you click on the save after uh, clicking on save click on the action tab and just click on scan okay scan completed no errors detected if there uh, by this window you can see that there is no error so you can proceed okay when you are 
past the entry just click on submit okay first you will submit this entry like and write the comments like submitted for approval like if the accountant is passing the entry he'll submit this entry for approval so i have submitted the entry it will not be submitted because the here already i have posted the entry so no further actions will be done after the entry is submitted either the higher authority will reject it or it will approve it if you have click on submit so your in, uh, status will be changed to submitted okay here it is showing as posted because i have done i have already posted but when you will click on submit uh, the status will be changed changed from working to submitted and the higher authority can either reject it or either approved it if it approved it then here uh, it will give some comments like the entry is approved or uh, it will uh, if it is not approved it uh, the higher authority will write as please check the entry or review the entry okay so it can be any if it is approved then the next step is the entry will be posted okay so now my entry will be posted and if it is posted my status will be reflected as posted okay after this you cannot make any adjustments okay and yeah uh, when the entry will be approved only when the um, period is open okay after passing this entries you can check the output through smart view in excel okay basically i have passed three entries i'll show you all first then we'll see the output through uh, smart view first entry was i have made the sales on credit my second entry is the revenue which i have credited that is revenue international in earlier entry i have credited is as a wrong so i want to transfer my revenue from international account revenue international account debit to revenue domestic account credit okay basically i am transferring the revenue from one account to another account okay so in the same entity i have selected all the povs okay and then i am debiting the revenue international account with 770 and i am crediting the revenue domestic account with triple seven zero okay basically i am re rectifying this entry after uh, passing the entry and selecting all the povs just click on save okay i and just uh, follow the same steps like click on submit and after that your status will be changed to submitted higher authority will uh, either approve or will reject either uh, it can approve or reject the entry if it is approved your status will be changed to approved or and after that it will be posted okay when it is changed to posted it means uh, now no further adjustments can be done now yeah, the entry is final yeah one more thing when you are passing the entry please select the correct movement like here i have selected for revenue changes in net income okay now we'll see the third entry which i have passed my third entry is cash received from here you can see from description cash received from trade receivables okay like 4000 is received from trade receivables so cash account debit to trade receivables okay in cash i have taken the movement as changes in cash and for trade receivable i have taken changes in accounts receivable i selected again all the povs click on save scan your entry then again follow the same process submit then it will be approved and afterwards it will be posted okay now i'll see the output for the three entries here also when i have connected through smart view um, i'll first write down uh, select all the povs which i have selected uh, in fccs application okay i'll select the same povs now my output will be reflected as see trade receivable balance is 3770 how it is coming first i have passed the entry with 3770 like trade receivable first entry was tra uh, trade receivable account debit to revenue international account credit this entry was passed with 3770 okay see revenue international 3770 here also it was earlier 3770 when i passed the second entry my uh, entry was revenue international account debit to revenue domestic account because i have transferred my revenue from revenue international to revenue domestic okay so minus triple seven zero because i have earlier credited it so for removing it it will be reduced minus triple seven zero and for uh, uh, crediting 
द अमाउंट इन रेवेन्यू डोमेस्टिक इट विल बी प्लस डबल ट्रिपल सेवन जीरो ओके नाउ माई थर्ड एंट्री इज आई हैव रिसीव द कैश फ्रॉम ट्रेड रिसीवेबल्स और वी कैन से फ्रॉम डेटर्स सो कैश अकाउंट डेबिट टू ट्रेड रिसीवेबल्स नाउ ट्रेड रिसीवेबल्स विल गेट रिड्यूस्ड बाय फोर थाउजेंड ओके सो कैश फोर थाउजेंड टू ट्रेड रिसीवेबल थ्री ट्रिपल सेवन जीरो सी earlier my uh, trade receiver was 7770 okay when i have received cash from them so it will be reduced by 4000 and the balance is 3770 okay so this is only reflected as final balance because when you will check my uh, ledger account in trade receivable is my one of the ledger account in there my balance is 3770 in my cash ledger the balance is 4 uh, 4000 and in my revenue domestic Ledger, my balance is triple seven zero. So this is the final output, okay, which you can see. So this is the way how you pass the journal entry or you do the journal posting. If you have any doubt, feel free to ask. Thank you.